If Nigeria must achieve its anti-corruption fight, citizens at the grassroots must be mobilized to adopt and drive anti-corruption values in the country. That was the outcome of the discussion at a ceremony to mark the end of the project Say No Campaign Nigeria. Helen Osamide again supports. In 2015, President Mohamedou Buhari came into office with the determination to fight corruption in the country, especially among the elites. But six years after, there are fears in some quarters, especially among opposition parties, that the anti-corruption fight is targeted at political enemies of the administration and has not impacted on the Nigerian economy. The Peer Advocacy and Advancement Center in Africa believes that the fight against corruption may never yield much until it is taken to the grassroots. As it wraps up its four years project on grassroots participation in the fight against corruption, it is advocating for members of the grassroots to be involved in their little ways in the fight against corruption. The anti-corruption fight, has, the citizens have outsourced it to, to government. Everywhere you go to, you hear people saying President Buhari's anti-corruption fight. But the reality is that the, the people who bear the, the debilitating consequences of corruption are in the communities. Get to the project site, find out what the contractor is doing about the project, and find out how far it has gone. Find out the quality of work that has been done on that project. Get engaged, get involved. Abu Mohammed is the community chief of the Riban Egbagi community in Abaji. The community, he says, have today witnessed a drastic change after several abandoned projects have been revisited following sensitization on their roles in facilitating accountable government in their local communities. There's a route from Pandagi, Rimba, Ibagi across the Ribagurara to Niger State. So uh, they give this contract more than eight to nine years. And we hear that they don't pay the money all. And up to now, they never do anything, except when this, uh, you know, say no to corruption come. Fighting corruption is a complicated process that requires synergy among all sectors. It is especially important that all sectors of society recognize and assume their responsibilities towards the ordinary citizens. Helino Samede Akins, TVC News.